All right, so The Witness is a puzzle game by the Jonathan Blow, the guy that did Braid, a very interesting platforming game that plays with the the concept of a platformer kind of it uh, it tinkers with what like Super Mario Brothers is and it uh, integrates the story into the game mechanics in a really cool way. And this is uh, the next game by him and his company or whatever. Uh, all I know is the one guy. I'm sure it wasn't just one person made the game. And it consists of a whole bunch of puzzles like this on an island that is somewhat reminiscent of Mist. Although I, I don't think there's the macro story stuff, but I don't know. We'll just have to see. Um, lots of saturated colors. And I should say, um, full disclosure, I've played a little bit of the game just to see if I wanted to stream it. So I, I did maybe 10 or 15 puzzles. So this is like puzzle number two. This is just teaching you the mechanics. And uh, the cool thing I like about this game is that there is no tutorial. There is no pop-up dialogue. There's no controls on the screen. Teaches you 100% of the game is learned through adding complexity in these puzzles. Hello, Sync Online, subscribe 21 months. That is a long time. Okay, so this one, we have two start points. Are they both winnable? No, okay, so this is teaching us that sometimes you have to pick the one that uh, will work. It's not always guaranteed to have a, uh, a solution. Okay, so that turned on this wire. Which is one of three wires connected to this. So this is basic, but basically what I've already done in the game up to this point is I, I got out of this gate. Oops. Okay, okay, nope. How do I get back up? I don't want to... Oh, you right click. Okay. You can, um... You can go into this puzzle screen, screen anywhere and have this cursor. You don't have to be at these little puzzles, and I'm wondering if that's going to uh, come into play at some point. Alright, so that one's simple enough. Alright, so follow the wire. Alright. Okay, so that went up here. This one's a little bit messier. Okay, so I think that was number two. Yeah, okay, so we got two out of three. It reminds you of the Thalos Principle. Yeah, I never played that game. Uh, but I can... Yeah, that is, that is definitely similar. That's where we came from. And I did the one in here, right? Yeah. Okay, so I guess we'll just wander around till we find another thing. Maybe back here. Very pretty island, I have to say. The, the art design is really cool. Even if it's... I mean, it's not really necessary. You could totally make this... Oh my god! You could totally make this an iOS game. Or like a, just a cell phone game that is just the puzzles. Uh, I wonder if they're going to do that, actually. Paul Pekka, 16 months. Thank you very much. Alright, so we've got two exits... And notice how this exit is right next to that wire, and this exit is next to that wire. I think that is probably going to be significant. Okay, so that wire... Did we just open the gate? I think we did. Or we opened, rather, the locks on the puzzle. Yeah, we did. 
I have a back... No, I do not have a background in computers. I have the background everybody has, that everybody uses computers. I don't have a... I wouldn't say I have a background in computers. Alright, so uh, we just opened that. That other puzzle, though, had a wire going a different direction that led over the wall. I think we should probably just go ahead and go activate it. This game could not be done on phone? Yeah, yeah, it could. You take out all the island stuff, and you just make it about the little puzzles, and when you beat one puzzle, you proceed to the next puzzle, and you learn how to beat the puzzles. That's what I mean. I don't mean the island stuff. I just mean the puzzles themselves. That is not the, the one I was looking for. But I did see, like, there was a wire going up over the wall. I think it was back here. Or out the window, or something like that. Can I go through here? Yeah, yeah, okay, so this wire right here. And I'm guessing it's gonna open that door. Later in the game, it will not work for iOS, trust us. Okay, I'll take your word for it. I, I was only talking about the line puzzles being put into an iOS game. That's it. I don't see why they couldn't release a limited version of the game like that. I don't know if they'd want to. I just understand they could. Um, can I sprint? Oh, you can sprint. Oh, that helps. <laughs> Otherwise, it's going to take forever to get anything done in this game. You can hold down shift. Can you crouch or jump or anything? You can't crouch, you can't jump. What does alt do? Nothing. Shift is a uh, move faster button, though. Alright, so instead... Oh, I wonder if I could have just uh, reversed my thing instead of... So that one's on now. That one's off. I guess, at least in this puzzle configuration, you can only have one of those, those wires on. But the gate's already open, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, please no spoilers. Uh, if you say that it's more than just puzzles, cool. <laughs> That's all the information I want. There's a puzzle right there. We'll get to that. I want to... Oh, did I already... Did I go too far? I want to go check out what's back here. Before I forget. Oh, so they are porting it to iOS. I wonder... I wonder how they're going to handle that. So, that, yeah, that gate indeed did open, so... That's pretty cool. You, uh, follow... I like the idea of following the wires around to figure things out. Okay, just scenery so far. All right. Aha, okay. A door and puzzles. So I don't think we've learned this mechanic yet, but I think what it is is uh, you've got to touch every one of these little dots. Like that. All right, cool. Another door. A puzzle that fell on the ground. Oh, the building got broken, huh? I guess that was once on the wall or something. Can we still do it? Oh, what's this little... There's a little triangle. Okay. No. All right, I don't know what this triangle is. We might have to learn... what to do with that at some other point. Okay. I have no idea why that worked. <laughs> Maybe we'll learn about that mechanic at some other point. Oh, what is this? Can I... 
Did I turn that on or? All the communities available to us. There's not one I would want to devote myself to, except for the Society of True Searchers, which has very few living members at any time. Albert Einstein, 1924. Huh. Okay, so that's not lit up anymore. A little. I didn't realize there'd be little audio cues. Okay, uh, where's the exit? Up there. All right, so if I do this, we can't solve it the way we did the other one. What if I start over here? Nope. What if I do that? Nope. Okay, uh, what if we start going down? Nope. <laughs> What if... Let's see. I don't know, maybe it's just going to be trial and error. So far this works, but then we get to here and there's a snag. So I've got to get around that. And then I've got to get around that next one. And if we get stuck, we can always just uh, come back later. Oh, the sip, the sip count going. Can I have subtitles? Yeah, we can do that. Oh, what if, uh, what if, I know, okay, I got it. Spiral, right? Buy him! What's going on, Milby? Uh, oh, Milby, uh, I started, I played a little bit of Dragon's Dogma, and I was looking for pawns, and I, I'm pretty sure one of your pawns showed up. He was like a level 72... Mini Stein guy with crazy armor and weapons and just basically nerfed the entire game for me. He just one shots everything. Okay. Exploration. Oh wait. So this is where we that's where we came out. Thought we were still outside of this thing. All right, so we already did that. What exactly did that door do? Nothing? Is it maybe it's just a shortcut later or something? Yeah, that's funny because I my guy I Hello! Uh the back of buff subscribed 21 months in a row. Um so my character, I made him as short as possible, and he is a uh a warrior guy too or whatever. And I, and I gave him the super deep voice, and then my pawn is also tiny, and he's got the high-pitched voice. Uh, so we, it's a funny group. <laughs> All little tiny people running around killing stuff. High-pitched, low-pitched, high-pitched, low-pitched, constantly. Yeah, I don't see the point of opening this room. Uh, I, I guess it got us this audio. Maybe that's important later, and it we we did that puzzle, but I don't see it connected to anything. Okay, well, moving on. Yeah, I haven't played that much of Dragon's Dogma. Uh, it seems okay. I'm not crazy about it right off the bat. Okay, wait, I, I'm not doing that one right now. And we have not learned the mechanics for the black dot, white dot stuff. Yeah. All right, so looks like that's what this is. 
So I think the mechanic is you just have to keep them split. Yeah, they can't be in the same area. Like a so. Mm-hmm. Oh, here we go. Yeah, you could probably remake this in Minecraft. Somebody ought to get Seth Bling on that. Alright, so we just did uh one, two, three, four, nine of those. I think that's probably just there to teach you about that mechanic with the black dots and the white dots. And I wonder if we will see similar things when they want to teach you a mechanic, just like a an isolated group of uh, boards like that. All right, new puzzle. Okay, so this is the uh, the dots. So you've got to move the the line over the dots to finish the puzzle. Like that. Hmm. Okay, I get it. Alright, so we got two start points. And there's no wires coming in and out of this thing, so it probably just means one of them will work. At least Digger John, what 11! Thank you very much, Digger John. Uh, oh, just subscribed. Okay, but that's a resub, obviously. Uh, okay, what am I doing here? So I can pass through that alternate starting spot. It's just a, a potential starting spot it doesn't block the line. Now we got three starting spots. Hmm, tricky, tricky. Okay, well, uh, if I go here, can't go this way. You could just do process of elimination, so I can't go this way, because then we'll, we'll never be able to get back to this one. Okay, so it's probably not that. If I do this, we can't get back to that one. If I do this, we can't get to that one. So it's not this one. We can just rule that out right off the bat. Uh, if we go this way, we can't get up to that. So it's it's not that one at all. Can't be that one. Similarly, uh, this if like going here and here doesn't work, then going here isn't gonna work. So that that's not it. So it might be that. Uh, it's not this way, obviously. Uh, and if we go here, then we can't get back to that. So it might be this, but it's not the other. Yoinks, yoinks, yoinks! Alright, not connected. Five! Finito! Brienne plays for 20 months! Thank you very much, Brienne. Uh, let's see. I guess we're just gonna wander around. Is there a map screen? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not in this game, huh? I guess we'll just keep going this way. We came from back there. I guess we'll wander up here into pink land. Yeah, well, I mean, if you don't approach this game trying to, like, pick it apart, I think you might get frustrated. Because it's, it's obviously trying to teach you how to do things in a very systematic way.
Okay, there's some boards in there. Oh, we've got a wire. Uh, okay. Maybe we activate something inside. Okay, so these are parallel. Got some ceramic pots. Alright. Okay, so that wire is right there. That wire is there. I think it connects to that. Then it goes over to there. It goes to that. Okay, whatever. There's a puzzle. Is this game about solving puzzles? Uh, yeah, that's the that's the basic gameplay mechanic, at least that I've encountered so far. People say there's more to it. We'll just have to wait and see. Oh, this one's tricky. Okay, so there's four. Oh, it's two and two. Okay. Uh, oh, I can't click on that one. I guess because it's covered by the bar? Trixie, Trixie. Alright, so do I get anything for solving it the alternate way? Oh, and that lit, that opened that, and now that wire's lit up. The environment looks like it's modeled in low poly blender. Well, yeah, it's definitely, it's a stylistic choice to have it be low poly. Can I um do this after the fact? Oh, I still can't even, that's a really weird, it's kind of hard to see, it's kind of small. Uh, it's really small on the screen. What's that do? Nothing? Just an alternate? So there's something there, and it's not lit up. This looks like this is gonna... Something's gonna happen there. There's a wire... Maybe we have to get that wire to light up somewhere? But oh, we can follow this thing now. Oh, it goes here? Okay. Alright, so this one... Um, I forget what this is called. This is uh, like radial symmetry. Is, it, is that what it's called? Something like that? Instead of uh, the normal axial symmetry. Is that right? Something to that effect. Boing! Okay. Next. Ooh. <laughs> okay. This one's a little bit messed up. Let me start here, because I'm going to be... This one will be uh, the one I'll be looking at. Shoot. Okay, that one melted or something. Got hit by the sunlight too much. Okay, so that goes back out and then over the, the wall. Yeah, it's, it's going up there. I guess that's the reflection down there. We should look... Um, so it looks like there was a wire underwater. We should look along the water to see if there's a wire coming up out of the water somewhere else. 
rotational symmetry. Maybe that's it. Did we come in this way, or did we go in the other side? I think... Is that the way we came in? Yeah. Alright, uh, let's look uh, over here. Nothing. Alright, let's go... I guess we're going up to the pink area. Oh, wait, hang on. What about these things? Okay, for a second there, I thought that might be a board that's just not as apparent, but it uh, looks like it's just a box to put stuff in. Alright, maybe not. Okay, so that leads up there. Uh, Alright, I guess we'll keep, we'll follow it. Uh, I kind of wanted to look over there, but while the, the line is lit, we should look over here, maybe. Okay, so we got to pass through all these points. Okay, so uh, we got to pick that up right off the bat. Okay. We'll blow him. More puzzles there, but those are not lit up yet. You notice? Okay, so look at this. You, do you see what I'm seeing right now? That's a puzzle. But it's this is not connected yet. Or it was broken at some point. Oh, man. That's pretty cool. Okay. I, I assume at some point that's going to be relevant. Where do I... Uh, I saw a door up here. Uh, oh. It's got a lock on it. But I can do it anyway. No, I can't. Oh, hang on. Oh, is this one possible? It's not possible until we get that lock off. So, we've got to get that stuff turned on, I guess. Oh, here it starts here. All right. Sir Barton's Lady, 21 months. Thank you very much, Sir Barton's Lady. Uh Okay. Okay. No. 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 <laughs> Try one thing, it's not it. Okay, I can't go past here, because then I, I will never be able to get that thing. So I've got to take an alternate turn. I've got to grab this. Oh, wait. Hang on. Here we go. Okay, so this one has the other kind of symmetry. No. Could it be something like this? No, it's not that. Might be like this, though. No, it's not like that, either. I'm kind of wondering if, instead of doing this, they're going to pass around each other. I suppose it's probably easier to just back up instead of... Um, Constantly restarting. Unless the puzzle is really complicated. Aha! Buy them, they did!
Yeah, suck it. There's no, ain't no thing. Chicken wang. Water's not very deep, huh? You just walk around and play Snake? Uh, kind of. The game progress. It te the game teaches you about the game by playing the game. There's no interface. There's no text. We did find a little bit of dialogue, but it was more flavor. It might have hinted at something later on, but it, uh, the game teaches you about the game by playing the game. So as we go through, I I'm just assuming, going to get a little bit more, like here, but now we got two colors. It's going to get more complicated. Oh. So, okay, let's just see if this works. Yeah. So I have to start... Oh, look at that. Okay, so the your cursor for this particular one is always blue, and the alternate is yellow. Okay. Boink. Oops. Okay, don't click T. Wait, hang on. Oh, okay. Pay actually, look at the thing. Don't just assume you can just... do it without thinking. Two exits, uh, but there's no wires going out of it, so I don't think it matters which one we end up at. And now we've got two of these darker ones. So we can pass through, but it doesn't matter with each, with what line. All right. Ooh, this one. Okay, I already screwed up. No, wait, I missed. I missed the yellow. Oh no, I can't get that. Dang it! So, okay, so what this means? That means I did it wrong. Is what it means. But I can't go. Can't go that far. I've got to reserve that space. So that means if I get this, we've got to come back up this way for this to be valid. But now I didn't get that one. Um, so that means this entire direction is invalid, I think. The yellow dot is there. What if I... Oh, no, I can't get that one. So I can't go up here, because then I'm crossing the yellow with the blue. So I already tried this. What if I went for that right now? Yeah, I can't, because of this guy. Nope, come on. Back up. Okay. Different idea. Mm -hmm. No, that won't work. Dang it. Hmm. Trixie, Trixie. So yeah, definitely will get more complicated. But now I can't get this. <clears throat> uh, all right. Oh, this is something I didn't think about. What if I uh, start with the blue guy here? That's, that's probably not going to work just from the way it looks. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's it. What am I doing wrong here? We have to get that there. If I go this way, two blocks over, we have to get that.
I can't go here because then I can no longer get this yellow one. And I can't go here. Can't go there. Okay, so it's not this. Back up. It's not that. It's not that. Okay. And I think this is the way I tried it before. Okay, so now I've picked up that one on the halfway spot. Hmm. How is backseating being treated? Uh, no spoilers, please. Um... Hints are fine as long as you're not super aggressive about it. We have to pick that one up if we come out here. And if I come here, we have to pick that one up. Can I get to this one before we go over there somehow? What if I do what if I do reverse it? I don't think it can be reversed like this though. Subscribe 16 months in a row. Thank you very much. Try solving it one step at a time. Okay, so I. Let's just assume we're going to go up. If I go up twice, we have to go up three. And uh, this is not a this is not solvable like this. So it's not going up three. If we go up two and to the right, that's not solvable because then we can't get that one. So it's not up two. If we go up one and to the right, I think we tried this one before and got farther. So let's just uh, let's follow through one more time. Snapples. Okay, but buy them. Yeah, I mean, if you get stuck, you just have to, you really have to do that. Trial and, not, tr not trial and error. You've got to systematically eliminate possibilities. Otherwise, like if, if you're just trying random stuff, you might try the same thing like a dozen times and not realizing it. Because you're not doing it s systematically. Okay, um... It's not this. Okay, so what I'm seeing is that to get these two blue dots, we have to go like that. We have to make this snake line. So I can't put the yellow line right here. So that means we have to pick up... ...these dots some, some other way. If I do this, they can't... they're trapped. Okay, so what if... I can't go there. Oh, no, wait, no, no, we don't have to do it that way. Because we can do it like this. Like that, like that, that's fine. So we can, uh, we can do this. That's fine. Right? Yeah, okay. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Okay, doke, so... To get to the end there, the yellow has to go this way. But why is the why is the yellow all messed up? It's uh like it's getting depleted in power, like there's not enough power.
Not enough power, Captain. I cannot do it. It's still solved, though. Oh, there's a there's a thing on the ground. Formerly, you appeared to me, O oh Lord, as invisible by every creature, because you are a hidden, infinite God. Infinity, however, is incomprehensible by every means of comprehending. Later, you appeared to me as visible by all. For a thing exists only as you see it, and it would not actually exist unless it saw you. For your vision confers being, since your vision is your essence. Thus, my God, you are equally invisible and visible. As you are, you are invisible, as the creature is, which exists only in so far as the creature sees you, you are visible. You, therefore, my invisible God, are seen by all, and in all sight you are seen by everyone who sees. You who are invisible, who are both absolute from everything visible and infinitely super exalted, are seen in every visible thing and in every act of vision. Therefore, oh my God, I must leap across Seriously? the wall of invisible vision to where you are to be found. But this wall is both everything and nothing. I think I see but what's you, happening here. Who confront as if you were both all things and nothing at all. Dwell inside. Jesus, how long are you going to talk? Which no natural ability can scale by its own power. Yeah, okay. So, what? Of Kusa, Shut up! Or, oh my god. Alright, so what I think is happening is we have a certain amount of length to solve these. Otherwise, we're going to run out of power, and we won't be able to solve this. So I think there might be simpler solutions to some of these where we use less length. Uh, I think that's maybe what we have to do. If that's possible. So I'm just wondering if this one, if I can do it with less line. Because uh, I kind of went a long way to do this. That uses a lot. Or like that. So I'm wondering, is there a way to start here? And do it? And does this use less? And will the one... I'm going to watch the one to the left. Does it get brighter? I don't think so. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Maybe that wasn't the uh, right idea. Blow. Uh, well, there's stuff down there. Maybe we should go look at that. How do I get down there? You, uh, you can't run off the ledges, by the way. There was another cable. Oh, okay, so we need more power, Captain. Uh, can I go across here? Yes. I just noticed that this one was lit, so I guess maybe this one will reinforce that or something. Oops, come on. What are you doing? This is just like the other ones, right? Why does that not work? Do we have to... All right, I have no idea. There's no little dots or anything. Do we have to use the full thing? I don't know. Okay, I don't know what that one does. Or why it's not working. Okay, well, uh, we can always... Let's, um... We can always go to a different area. Until we, we might learn something about the game. Can I go up through here? We might learn something about uh, what to do about this. Uh, 
So there was, there's more stuff than this. Uh, we can come back to that later. Oh wait, did we do that one? Is that lit? Or did we, did we, we started there. Okay, that's where we started. Okay, we've got uh, a stack of tires. Okay. Elevator shaft. No wires. There's a uh, a tube. Okay, we've got a building, some ruins. Ooh, okay, so there's puzzles down there, and they're not square; they're hexagonal. There's a hexagonal one. Okay. Coolio. Uh, oh, where do you start? Okay. Where do I... Do I always start there? Do we have to randomly pick the right one? It says, uh... There's six exits. The wire is down there. Because I'm starting in the middle, I can only go out, out around the outer edge, right? What if I go... Okay, what other... Is there any clues as to what we're supposed to be doing? Uh, there might be some puzzles out there, too. So I totally don't mind skipping around stuff, because I think the game is trying to teach us stuff, and if we haven't been to the right area to learn the right thing, then uh, it's, pro it's probably more better use of our time to uh, keep looking around till we are taught what we need to know. These are not on until we figure that one out, huh? Okay, let's go check out these statues. And let's actually, let's trace the waterfront, see if we notice anything. I've got a shadow. <laughs> notice that. What's that? What's that right there? That's a puzzle. There's a puzzle down there. Is this a puzzle? Can we... Okay, maybe not. Looks significant, though. BAM! What does that do? Oh, Snapples. Snapple apples. Complete. Come on, buddy. Oh, yeah. Wait, where are you going? Let's be friends. Okay. Is that, is that like in the air still? So I, I was looking around and I noticed that, uh, I noticed that that was, it looked like the start and it overlapped with that. I guess you just have to be standing in the right spot. So we should definitely be keeping our eye out for uh, things that look suspiciously round. It hit the tire stack, okay. Click around, click around. There's a boat. 
There was a puzzle down there. If we can find a way to get down to the beach. I need some rat away after that. <laughs> Staircase, okay. Oh, can I seriously not walk down that? Come on, game. Give me a break. Oh, it's gl you see, it's got little glowy dots. That means something. Am I just not standing in the right spot? It would have to be, like, up in the air for it to be circular. Okay, we're not getting the glowy dots here, the little green puffs. So, what if we what if we stand here? No. Maybe this one doesn't work cuz we can't be in the right spot. But there was I think there was a similar thing over there. What if we're real far away? See, so yeah, it's got Little bubbles popping up or something. But I don't think I can get to a spot where that is circular, which I think is what the game is wanting. Okay, where uh, where were those stairs? Did I not see stairs? There's a puzzle. Yeah, I think I will put this on YouTube, yeah. <clears throat> I have no idea how long the game is. I'm sure I've just barely scratched the surface, but uh, yeah, I don't know how uh, many streams it'll take to beat it. Oh. Whoa. Okay, so we got a bunch of dots, and we got some shapes, and the shapes are different colors. This looks like one of the more advanced ones. Like, we haven't even got to the, an area that introduces these shapes. I think what it means, though, is we've got to do, like, that kind of thing. But because there's all the black dots, we've got to also, like, hit up every single dot. And then I think in case... encase these things in uh, the shapes that are illustrated by the dots. If I come over here, like that would not work, obviously. Okay, so how do I go about enclosing this one and covering all the dots? Like that? Like that. Okay, can we go the other direction? Yes. Okay, so this works both directions. How, oh, okay, hang on. You notice the blue ones ha are hollow. The blue ones are hollow. So if... Um, let me just test something, right? Oh, I guess I can't test it, because this puzzle's too advanced. It's got the black dots. I need the puzzle that introduces the mechanic to test how it actually works. I think we have to do it like this. I don't think you can do it like this. But I'm wondering if the hollow blue dots mean that they don't have to be exactly contained. Because I can't exactly contain that blue dot, because it's not on the edge, and it's only one. So can it be... I don't know what that means. Uh... And I can't do that one if I come over here. Okay. So maybe we'll come up here first. I can do that. And then that. But then that's, uh, that's stuck there. What if, uh, what if we try going up like that and doing this guy the other way? Which was like this. Oh, look at that. Oh, that lines up better, doesn't it? Yep. Uh, but then I can't do that. So, that means before we come to 
here, we've got to do everything. All, all this has got to be done. Right? I don't... Oh, now that, that guy's not there. Oh, crap. Okay. So, I need those... I need these two dots down here open. Those two dots need to be open, which means we're coming back across there, which means I have to do this. Uh... Hmm, crap. Trixie! I want those open. Okay, so what if I come like this? Ah! <laughs> okay, that's not it. But uh, I'm going to come back to that door later when we've been introduced to the individual mechanics. And I can test how they work. Because uh, I could spend a lot of time on that door trying to figure out the mechanics when there's... There's three different mechanics for that door. And uh, we've only been introduced to one of them, the black dots. Here's another one. So we found another one. Oh, there's another triangle guy. I don't know the triangle mechanic either. But this one's small enough. We could just do trial and error. Oops. The perspective is a little weird. The in I went as far to the left along the edge as I could. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. I don't know. Okay, so... Can we go in the water? No. Okay, so uh, we still haven't gone to the pink tree spot, so I guess we'll head over there. Oh, uh, we'll come back to this door. I think I was... I can figure it out if I can just test the mechanics individually. And I want to see where that puzzle thing went, and I also want to take another look at this guy. Oh, that's not a circle. Oh. Would it be a circle from down there, those two halves? Is that going to line up with the sun? Did I solve the black and white squares? Yeah. No, we're not... Uh... High enough off the ground. Oh, but it's got little sparkles. But I do maybe uh maybe from up there. That's not the right uh, angle though. Uh oh, is it possible to get up on that rock? That would not be the right perspective either. Let's go stand up here again. I already already did I already did that one. That's the wrong angle. Uh, okay, we we can uh, we can chase to see where those sparkles went. We can hit up the pink tree area, red tree area. There's a tower over there. And um, is this different? I guess I could do just like trial and error. So let's see, there's six different directions and six exits. So there's 36 possibilities, although you can go in different directions. So that's six times 12, 72 possibilities. I don't know if that math is right. There's a lot of possibilities. 
if you're just going to try to randomly guess what the logic here is. I don't know what the logic is, though. Hmm. I don't know. I'm looking around, like, stuff on the ground, trying to see some kind of, like, symbol or something. What about down there? That's the same stuff. Okay, we'll come back to it. Maybe that'll be introduced uh, somewhere else. Oh, hang on. Lots of circles. This is for sure a puzzle. <laughs> I guess I just have to be standing at the right spot to activate it. Oh, it works here. Okay. Was that the completion? Over there again. To the tires. I can't get past that spot. But I can't hear... Is it because of the glare of the sun? Yeah, the glare of the sun completes the line. You see that? If I try it here... I can't even do the puzzle here. But I couldn't get past that thing because the glare, the glare of the sun wasn't there. What if I stand right... There. I can't do the puzzle from there. Okay, I can do it from here. Can I move forward and back? There's no glare. I'm not doing trial and error, I'm figuring out mechanics. Okay, whatever, we already did that one. Uh, okay, what if I'm... where am, I'm standing on one of these things. Is that what's important? Let's try standing on one of these things. No, it doesn't work. Uh, but at some point, I think we'll, pro we'll probably be able to get up there because there's scaffolding and stairs and stuff. All right, let's uh, let's go along the coast. I didn't finish the last area yet. I know, I'm just, uh, I'm exploring, like, we don't... Little piece of the, of the game is giving you clues to how other pieces of the game are going to work. And there were sparkles leading off in that direction, so I'm, I'm going to be hopping around as I figure things out. And returning to areas later. Yeah, that's obviously a circle there. Okay, well, I guess we'll just head down here, see what this is all about. Wires. This is not on, right? Not on. Oh, what about... I can't even look at that. That is on, though. Okay, so there's a puzzle down there. Oh, hang on. Go over here. Can't get down there. Okay, tunnel thing. There's a building. Is this the building we were already in? No, this is a different one. river thing. Although I guess it's more like a, uh, it's a little, what do you call it, like a, a channel? A 
a canal. That's what I'm thinking of. It's a canal. <clears throat> okay, there's a wire there. Okay, this one is available. Oh, no, it's not. It's closed. We got a dot, a double dot, a little triangle to do. A little asterisks. But it's uh, it's locked. I don't think we can complete it. What about... Hang on. Hang on! No. Okay. Why not at least try? Okay. Looks like the path leads down there. There's a windmill. This island is... I mean, just the game. It is very pretty. Just to look at. I really like the art design. And it's it's abstract enough that it's not distracting. Like, the abstraction of the the art design fits well with the puzzles not being just puzzles and being part of the island, you know? Because the color palette of the puzzles matches the color palette of the island. Alright, so... We gotta keep uh, keep them separated. Do 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 do. Can I do it like this? Okay, now we got the shapes. So here's where the shapes get introduced, or at least one area where the shapes get introduced. So we've got to outline the shape, right? This is how it works. So I, I did that one exactly. Can I flip the shape? It would be like that? No. So what if I go around this way? Uh... I don't think it's possible to do... Can I combine them? Oh, I think this is it. No, it's not. Oh, because that, that wasn't in there. Duh. Okay, so just some basic logic. There's no way to, to make that shape exactly like it is because it's on the corner. So that means I, I must be able to flip it. Otherwise it wouldn't be possible. Must be able to, to flip it around like that. So can they be together? They can't. Uh, I haven't done the Tetris tutorial yet. So this assumes you already know how they work. Hmm. Like, you could figure it out eventually like this, but it would take a lot of trial and error. Alright, we'll come back to this once I've found the Tetris tutorial. If you want to call it that. Okay, canal down through there. Uh, I'm not sure if I've been to that building yet. Okay, so here's the orange area, I guess. Okay. <laughs> Something's going to jump out and bite me. All right, here's one. What's behind here? Figure that one out. That was easy. Um, yellow. 
Okay, what's, uh... What was that sound? Oh, the door closed on me. So there's no identifying marks. It's just a grid. There's no dots. It's yellow, though, which is a, it's a different color. Is there anything, like, on the ground? It hasn't really taught me how puzzles work outside of the puzzles. Like, I haven't been able to look on the ground and see a shape and replicate the shape. The, the logic has always been in the puzzles themselves. This looks like a puzzle right there. Maybe I'd have to be standing... Maybe over here? Maybe maybe there's got to be some electricity turned on or something? Oh, I can't see it. Maybe from above here? What about here? No, it doesn't work. Alright, so let's just uh, try some things. Okay, so I went like every other... We can do all the spaces. We do some kind of like spirally doodad. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, we'll come back to you then. I'm wondering if, uh, oh, circle. Clockwise to get into here. Clockwise. I went around the edge. Is it the... It, wait, hang on. Is it uh, the same on the other side? So, I'm going clockwise. From bottom... From uh, 6 o'clock to 6 o'clock. Yeah, it's the same thing. It's got a cooldown on it. Does anything happen when the door closes? Do I have to do it before the door closes? Now we can try it. Hmm. But, um... I mean, this, uh... It's not the same configuration, though. Like, you can't go around in a circle like that. So I'm not sure I'm not sure how to take logic from that and apply it to this. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, guys, can you, um, can you take it easy on the hints? Everybody's spamming shadows. And, okay, I get it now, shadows, but, uh, l let me figure it out on my own, okay? Huh, okay, so... Oh, I see. The door is in the way for this one. Gotta expose it for the, uh, to see what the shadows are. Okay, that one's done. The hell was that? Okay, so... That's that. It was something else. Oh, this whole thing fell down. Because this, uh, that little wire got lit up. Does that wire continue?
Maybe I've got to activate something before that'll work. Okay, anyway. Uh, okay, so... Let me just try it and discount the bars first. Oh, that worked. Okay, I was wondering if I had to, like, do something to get rid of the bars themselves. But apparently I just have to, uh, the only thing that matters are the sticks, I guess. White Luigi, subscribe for 15 months. Thank you very much, White Luigi. Uh, Alright, so... Before, it was only the branches that mattered. And I can't really see any branches. Let me just get a uh, perspective on this roof. I don't think that's the kind of thing that we can interact with. Like, to get the roof to move or something like that. Mm. Whoops. Wrong one. Okay. Maybe we'll, uh, we'll say... Only the thin lines matter? Just as a hypothesis? Okay. That worked. That's not it. And I think the sun doesn't move, does it? There's no, like, day-night cycle. So these shadows are always going to be in exactly the configuration. Holy cow, that's loud. Shut up, I know where I need to start. Uh, who's that? Mob Browning, six months in a row. Thank you very much, Mob Browning. So, obviously, some of the shadows are going to be discounted. Previously, it was only the tree that mattered. And looking at it from here... The only... I guess that stick right there... I think that's a stick. <laughs> yeah, it's a different color. Okay, so that is this right here, right? And it's sitting on crossbar. Doesn't seem like it quite lines up, but I guess it has to. Crossbar, crossbar. Okay. So I think we have to avoid the stick. That's what I tried to do the first time. Whoops. I tried to go down like this. Like that. But that's not it. Uh, maybe I have to come up through... There? Can I just do that? Oh. <laughs> Oops. That was easy. No. It's not going to let you do that twice. Okay, so the bars don't matter. Sticks do. It's hard to really see where the... Oh, alright. It's hard to see, like, which is which. It... That's my hypothesis. It might not even be correct. Okay, we just lit that up. And this one got lit up, too. To here? Dude, I can't even see the whole thing. Where's the sun? Okay. Seriously? Come on. Where's the sun? Uh, hmm. Is there another exit? No. 
Seems like we have to go this way. Oh, I have to visually be able to see it to be able to... Might be something like that. Okay, maybe it's not that way. Can I... I can't move while I'm trying to do the puzzle. Can I uh, get to a different vantage where I see the whole thing? Maybe I have to use that right side and I'm, I just can't see it from here. You gotta be able to see, like, the whole thing. <clears throat> yeah, well, I was trying to do it logically, but this one is... Small, so I mean, you could brute force this one because the grid is not very big. And I, I just can't see. Oh, you know what? Look at the, uh, okay, look at the overlap here. You see that? So, does it have to be like that? How can I, oh, I can see it from here. No, that's not it. Dang it. It looks like I can see this shape on the, uh, like this core 10, whatever this stuff is. What if it's... Hmm? Come here. Huh. I don't know. All right, we're coming back to it. There's another one over here anyway. Was it this one? Yeah. Okay. So over here, maybe we have to follow the shadow for this one. Maybe that other one we had to follow the shadow too. Maybe that's what I was doing wrong. Yeah, okay, we're following shadows now, instead of avoiding them. This is like some uh, MS Paint cheat code. Okay, where the hell do you go? Over here. Seriously, man, at least use Photoshop if you're going to tell me how to do it. Oops, I did not complete that one. Kerplam! Alright, so that goes this way. Into the ground again. To this one? No, did we do that one already? I don't think so, because one of the wires is not lit. Um... Okay. Good. And that goes down here. Oh, that's broken. See how that, that line is broken? So is this not going to work? Okay. Oh, something opened. Something opened! What opened? Over here? It sounded like it was over here. This. I think this just opened. Okay, so I assume we're following shadows still.
Maybe. <clears throat> okay. I'm not really exactly sure. Like if I if I want to go where the shadow is unbroken, you run out of options pretty quick, so I'm not sure exactly how to get there. Hmm. Let me back up for a second. Maybe, uh, so this gate, oh, does, can we open the other side of the gate somehow? There's a wire there. Is there a wire on the other side? Maybe we have to, uh, get the, the, the gate out of the way so we can see the tree shape on the thing. Or maybe not. Yeah, I think we need the actual tree. I think the gate shadow doesn't count. Maybe? So if it's doing, it's doing like this squiggly doodad. So, let's see. That little, this thing right there, is that, I think. And it goes up that little branch, I think is, is that that? Is this how I'm supposed to do this? I'm supposed to like just look back and forth until I see it? But it's going diagonally, so... I'm not sure if I'm really tracing it properly because of the diagonal lines and whatnot. I think we could get this door out of the way, but I don't think there's another wire, or at least I don't see one. Hmm. around maybe uh we have thinking about this wrong maybe this one you don't want to follow the shadows all, all the ones that led up to this were like this let's go backwards like that there's a little up thing then we run, we basically run out of branches. If we if we're just going by shadow, I don't think there's enough there. So I think maybe we do have to use the door. I don't know. I feel like I'm uh, I'm missing something. Okay, fine. Come back later. Was there uh was there one? We open that one. Was there one down here that um like it, uh, I think I opened two thingy doos. There was a, a wire that split. I think I only followed that one. Right? Maybe. I think I left one of these undone. Okay, so this was this one was the last one. Oh, and then it went off in that direction. Okay, I did that one. We've been in and out of here. Did all of those. 
Uh, there was a split. The one over there I didn't get. Okay, so I think I did all of these up there, and that led to the door that... Oh, oh this is not on. Where's this coming from? Kind of hard to trace the wire when it uh, disappears underground all the time. Is there... Th there might be a... Uh... Oh. There is another wire for the other door. Okay. <laughs> My initial thought was right. So we have to open the other door. Okay, so I wonder if we'll open that up uh, when we do this other side. That would kind of make sense. From a game design standpoint of like laying out these uh, puzzles. Um, was this the one that tricked me? That I couldn't get? Can I get, like, super duper close? Oh! You can get even closer! Okay, that's what I was doing wrong. See, that's what you do. You take a little time away, you come back, and you can view it in a, a new light. Let me alt-tab for a second. I had a little pop-up from uh, Twitch. Let me close these things. Okay, joke. See, no, no big deal. Uh, it's only ob it's a, Some of these puzzle things, they're more obvious when you're not the one playing the game. Um, that's true of a lot of, like, gameplay videos. It's easy to say, oh, it's obvious. Okay, so, uh, we are trying to track... How am I supposed to see what the shadows are doing? Because, because I'm the one playing the game, I've got to get them right every time. And you watching on the stream, you only have to get it right once. And you can, like, point your finger and say, aha, isn't it obvious? When you only have to uh, figure it out once. I think we, we go through here. Can I see the shadow somewhere? I can see that one on the wall. I can see it here. So... Can I even do it from here? I guess I can. Okay. Let's see. The Hang on. This uh, column thing cuts off right there, so then we go down, left, down, then up, like that, okay. Okay, can I see the whole thing? Where? Oh, it's right there, okay. This one, oh, it's got multiple starts. Okay, that makes more sense. Can I get to a spot where they will actually line up properly? If I could get up on this rock, I could. Do I think people would be speedrunning this game? I don't think so. I mean, what would be the point? So this, uh, this little thing cuts off to here, but the... The board isn't big enough for me to take advantage of that. So there's another start spot there. I don't think I can... I can't, like, leave the board. Because I need to go out of bounds here to go there and then come back there and around to solve it. If I'm looking at it right. I think I'm looking at it right. Where's the sun?
can't really... I don't see uh, what the solution is here. Because it looks like the... the the sh We've been learning that the shadows will show you, like, what the pattern is when this column, for instance, blocks that. We just follow that. And that worked. This one, however, the shadows on the, the column are behind it, and they're off the side of the grid. This puzzle looks simple. They all look simple once you've done them. If you look at, if you like puzzle games, I think it's worth the price. Yeah, there's two starting spots, but uh, so what? I can't see enough of the... Hmm. Yeah, this one doesn't seem to make any sense. At least from what we've done in the previous ones. It seems like you have to leave the grid for the line to connect. I don't know how to do that. Like, it seems like you have to go off the side of there to do that. If you start here, it looks like there's too much shadow. Let's, uh, let's just look up here for a second. There's a doorway. It's closed. After we're done with this one, I guess they're just kind of going around in a circle. Not been in there. Is that a painting? Kind of cool, the sounds are originating from this tile, because I'm standing farther away. They're a lot quieter. How far away can you do these? Oh, pretty far, huh? It's kind of hard to be precise when it's that small, though. Trust the game, it wants you to succeed. How does that help? Is there more than one exit? I don't see another exit. What if we connect the uh, these two? Boink. No. I don't know. This one's kind of got me stumped. What 
We can't follow the shadows either. This is not the follow the shadows area. Oh wait, there's a pattern. What's that on the back there? Oh no, that's that's probably for that one. I'm trying to look at it from different perspectives and stuff to see if like stuff is lining up with these things. Is there something else in the way that I could back up far enough to see? Because everything uh, I'm looking at for patterns is behind that board instead of in front of it. Go very close. Am I supposed to? Oh, when I uh, when I actually do that, I get farther away. Go very close. I'm very close now. Can't get much closer, but it backs me up as soon as I click on it. I don't know. This one's got me stumped. Let's, uh, maybe we should review. Maybe that'll help. Okay, so we did one there, and then we got the split cable. Here we are avoiding shadows and, uh, tracing... We're avoiding shadows from uh, the trees, but not from the metal. Okay, so then it splits. <clears throat> then uh, then uh, the shadows started getting covered, so we had to look at the pattern. We're still avoiding shadows at this point. Avoiding shadows, but trying to connect the uh, the shadow that's on the plate. Same thing here, you get close, you can do it. Here the shadow is up there. Here the plates are behind it. This is what's throwing me off, is because it changed. This is the one that changed. And it, what it looks like is that the shadow, the path we're supposed to trace, goes off the the board. So I don't know what to do. <clears throat> the shadow is offset to the board. I've tried uh, tracing this. Which would be like that. But it's not that. What if we start here? Uh, like this. I've tried this uh, a number of variations before. 
I don't know. I don't know about this one. Oh, I'm supposed to do the thing. And that would do the other thing to make the thing. Oh. Oh. The panel looks like it's been shifted over. Okay, so let's let's try this. Let's take the pattern here. We've got this much. And let's shift everything over two spots to where the other starting spot is. So let's trace a line here, but assume we're following this shade pattern. I guess because did it break and fall over or something? So it would be like this. Okay, and then we pass onto the shadow in the background. Like that. That's tricky, man. That's pretty tricky. Whew. Okay, so... I, th I guess that's our shadow. We've only got the one starting spot. I guess I can do it from back here, huh? It's gonna be hard to be precise. Um, okay, so the shadow gets cut off there. Looks like it does this. Yeah, okay, that was it. Uh, all right, so where's the starting spot? Bottom right. Okay, so there's uh, that thing right there. The sun is way back there. Let's just back up for a bit. Okay, that's the only shadow I see. It's to the left, though. Well, let's just trace it. It goes like uh, like that. And then what? Oh, okay. Left, right, up. Like, wait, what was it? Like that? Yeah. Nailed it. Okay, so where does that, uh, back here, right? Whew, man, this is stressful. <laughs> Getting worn out. I think I go over here, like that. Uh... Nailed it. Voice try. Some of them you just get stuck on for ages and then you blow through a bunch of them all at once. Okay, like... Ooh, hang on. Are we being tricked here? Yeah, I... okay, so... Is the puzzle being overlaid twice? So do I do, whoops, two little humps and one little hump. I guess we can try two, but it kind of seems like we're being tricked here. Or we're not seeing the whole thing. Maybe I need a different angle. Can I get up higher? Can I go through here? It's probably going to stop me, isn't it? Oh, this is actually a good angle. 
But I can't see the middle. I have a... Like, the one, the one in the back is, um... Lower or something. It's farther back, so... Okay. Uh, okay. Let me, let me be, um... I'd like to be right here. Okay, that's good. Okay, let's try two humps. So... Yeah, it can't be like this. Because, um... We've got to do a... We've got to do this shape at the end. Oh, I can't even see the whole thing from here. So I can't uh, do the puzzle from there. Oh, now you're going to move me. What the hell, man? What about from here? Can I do it from here? Good. Oh, come on. I thought that was it. It seems like that one on the back is uh, lower than it actually... It, it's visually lower than it is on the board. Come on. How is that not it? Up. Like, I think uh, I've got to go from... You see how this... I think it connects to that. Do I not go all the way over? Maybe I don't... Yeah, I do. Maybe I don't. Let's try like this. Oh, but then you can't. Over... Up, left, left, over, or is it just like this? Maybe it's just like that. Aha! Okay, I was close. What just opened? I think that was the other side of the gate we just opened. So we should be able to do this one now. You want ta tacos? Would be awesome. It'd have to be good tacos, like authentic Mexican tacos, not. Not this hard taco shell crap. Yeah, the other door's open. Ah! Fantastic. Okay. Uh, oh wait, hang on a second. Okay, I think I understand. Okay, so, um, we had to do two halves, like two areas. Each one unlocked a different door. This door was unlocked where we were avoiding shadows. And this door was unlocked. This was uh, tracing shadows, right? So I think on one half of the map we have to avoid shadows. The other half we have to trace them. Yeah. Okay. So avoid shadows here. Trace shadows here. Trace. We cross over. We avoid. Trace. Mm. What's happening? What's going on? Oh. That's happening. I'm just waiting. I'm seeing what's happening. Something's happening. We still haven't gone back to uh, investigate the stack of tires, by the way. It's gonna shoot a laser in the air? Oh my god, it's gonna shoot us. No, it's not. Oh man. Okay. That's some missed stuff right there. Okay, so does this mean we finish this area? Or do we have to get a bunch of these beacons to all laser beam? 
It's like the Death Star. When the Death Star is powering up, it does like choo, 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 with all the green lines. When all the green lines connect, they shoot and they destroy Alderaan and a bunch of people cry. Okay, so I assume I'm, we're done with here. And uh, let me just see. Is this door still closed? There's a door down here. Yeah, okay, so that's still close. All right, so uh, let's go check out the tires. And uh, I, th I think we skipped some stuff because I've been going around the edge. So I kind of want to backtrack a bit back to where we started and uh, look over things. Cool puzzle. We haven't gone over there at all. Uh, I was trying to head for the pink trees, but I saw this, so I'm getting distracted. This looks like a puzzle here. I wonder if this was open before, if I had to open it. Okay. These are not lit up. Can't get over there. Oh. I have a feeling this is a giant puzzle. <laughs> uh, I don't want to run through that right now. <laughs> I'm in no kind of mood for that at just this moment. Maybe if we get a better vantage. Is this a, a line puzzle or do you have to run through it? Oh, there's a puzzle on that gate right there. There's a puzzle right there. Let's go do that. Oh my god. This is uh this is like in Return to Oz. Everybody got turned to stone by the gnomes. Uh-huh. Is this the same as that? I think so. But I think we have to walk it. Can you do it this way? No, you can't. This is just showing you your progress. Okay. Um. All right. Let's see if I remember it right. But we can check our progress, right? Yeah. Suck it! Nailed it! Oh, then now it's trickier, because we've got to uh, do... Oh, actually, this one's easy. Hmm. But this and that are different. Can I walk around the edge? Yeah, I can walk along the edge. Okay, so like right here, this is busted. There's some other busted stuff. Oh, well, I started it. Uh, okay, so I can't go too forward and just walk down the middle. So I actually have to... Can I go all the way around the edge? I can't see it, can I? I can't go all the way... Okay. So we need to do this. Can I retrace my steps or are they always on? Like if I go back where I've already been? Okay, let's go look at the thing again. So can I just go straight across and then down? Ooh, is this going to work? Yeah. Come on, I did it! Hey! How does that not work?
Oh, derps. Okay, how do I reset? How do I reset you? Oh, probably here. So, I've got to, uh, instead of doing that, I've got to... Okay. Same kind of thing, though. <laughs> Double check. So, come here. Go halfway down. We've got to cross the map again, is all. Before we go back. So, that's busted right there. So, we have to go this way. Right? Um... I can't cross here to look at the map, can I? But we isolated those and those, so we should be fine to just do this. Yep. <clears throat> Are they trying to escape and they were turned to stone? Kind of looks that way. Or she was kidnapping puppies. She had bags full of puppies and she was turned to stone. Oh, this has got the uh, the Tetris thing. We still haven't been to the Tetris spot. Okay, uh, let's come back to the spot. Uh, these are kind of neat. But uh, I did want to go back to where we started and kind of... I feel like we've skipped past some of the early game puzzles that would be instrumental in learning some mechanics. So uh, let's try to actually go back if we can. How the hell did I get here? I walked through this thing, didn't I? Yeah. Okay, I can see the pink. Let's head for the pink. This game is so pretty. <laughs> it is so pretty. Uh, okay, don't get distracted. Just head... Oh my gosh, look at that. Just head back where you... I want to go up there. <laughs> head back to where you mean to go. We can explore this later. After I do this. I don't even know what the logic there is. We'll, we'll come back later. There's the pink trees. Is this the first play session? Yes. I've been streaming for like two hours. I don't know. Something like that. Okay, pink trees. We never did pink trees. They're still... Uh... These things are not turned on. Oh, that's right. Branches. Fruit? Is it the fruit? Where did that start? It starts there, I guess. Uh, let's back up some more. So... I just kind of want to reiterate what we've done. The first environment puzzle I discovered was that, but it didn't seem like it worked. I wonder if I can fiddle with it a little, get it to work. Oh, maybe I didn't have the right perspective. Like, we got stuck here because we ran out of power for our thing. Oh, I need to be... Oh, I get it! You need to be up there! So, this line doesn't connect. Oh, yeah, it does. Well, I did something there. I was going to say, um, when I tried it here, it, I don't think it worked. Yeah, it won't connect. I thought it would have to go up there. Maybe I don't? Did I just turn that thing on? We never finished this because uh, the yellow line got too faint. There's something, I think I looked at this too, but uh, there was like mechanics I was missing for that. Let's go, let's do the tree thing. Oh, wait, uh, hang on. Oh. We've, uh... Whoa. Okay. Can I trace these?
Some of them are lit up. Uh, I don't I don't know if I could see the designs on these before. Are these the ones I've activated from the environment puzzles and they've been sent over here? Oh, I think these were... Um... Okay, so this one right here, I think I just did this one. That's that, because it's just... Uh... That's the shape of it. It's just the circle and then you go straight up. So this must be the shapes of the ones. So I could probably look for them. Can I, can I make this line go the other way? I don't think so. Oh, hang on. Um, the reflection is in the way it looks like. What if we're down here? BAM! Fist bump. Alright, that's pretty cool. So it was, uh... Right below the other one. I don't know that they're spatially relevant. I just... It's probably just a sequence. There's a third one there. I, I wonder if I should just look for it over there, though. It might even be a, uh... A thing where... Hmm. You know, there's like different lines on the roof. Can I just find a different perspective where the lines match these things? All of the ones in this progression might be that building right there. So I want to go up, left, and down. There's a line on the roof there. So if I go far enough over... I think I might need, maybe I do need to be up, I think I might need to be like right there. Okay, you see how these, that, those lines are almost connecting. But I need to be higher, I think. Mm, I think I'm, I think it's something like that. Am I going to play Seven Days of Die? No, I don't think so. Uh, I, I tried the game out. It doesn't really... Um... Art design is very important to me in a uh, in experiencing a game. And I just... I can't stand the look of the game. I can't get past the fact that the game looks terrible. And I'm already kind of playing a survival game vaguely similar, like Ark. I mean, they're not, they're not the same game, but they're... Of a similar genre, I guess you might say. They're survival games. And I just find Ark way more appealing. I might be uh, on the wrong track. Okay, anyway. But uh, I think uh, that's that's cool. Okay. We can definitely look around for survival... Or survival. Um, environment puzzles. Is that one? That cloud is very circular for part of its shape, isn't it? <laughs> I'm seeing circles everywhere. Oh. We're getting the sound. I, see how I don't get that sound here? And there's a line on the ground there. Okay, can I connect that yellow line up with something? Does it have to be the size of my cursor? Yeah. Factorio is ugly as hell. Uh, I think Factorio has a consistent art style and it has a definite charm in the way it looks. I wouldn't say it's ugly as hell. Just because it's like 2D and uses... The, the graphics aren't of the highest resolution. Minecraft has a great art style. It doesn't have...
great graphics. Uh, okay, where was that one? Okay, I don't see it on here. Is there a different obelisk? Is it that? Magma fish, 19 months. Thank you very much, Magma Fish. Okay, anyway, uh, let's go to the trees. We can backtrack and look for more environment puzzles. I, by trees, I mean pink trees. Obviously, there's trees all over the islands. Just saying trees is not enough information for you. So, branches. Okay. Fruit is in the tree. Okay, but what perspective counts? Probably the other one. Um, so we want to go left, right, right, left. Left, right, right, left. Those trees are pink. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one crosses, but I let's just go with the branches and uh so left, right, right, right. Left, right, right, right. This, these ones are easy. These are ones that are closer to where you start too though, so I, I kinda jumped ahead, I guess. I skipped past here. Uh left. This is about the point where they would throw a curveball at you. Maybe not. Um, left, right, right. Do we already have this one? It's shut down. Why did the line turn off? Untouched wagon, 17 months. Thank you very much. Do it. I have to do this one again? Every time I get one wrong? Huh. Okay. This is a game mechanic that doesn't need to be there. You mean the, uh... The having to redo puzzles you already done? Okay, so, uh, last time I tried to do... I tried to do... I did um, left, right, right, left, and that was not correct. Is there? Is it like rotating, or am I looking at it from the wrong side? Maybe we should try it from this direction. So right, left, left, right. Right, left, left. Oh. So how do I know which direction matters? Trial and error? I don't know. Because the other ones, the sign was like directly facing the tree, but then I had to, I had to figure out which side was right, and I just, I just guessed. I don't know. <clears throat> um, oh, you know what? Hang on, I think I saw the clue. I think I figured it out. See how this one has got a branch missing? This branch is broken. Okay, so it's not it's not symmetrical. So you just need to figure out. Yeah, this one's got a branch missing too. All right, never mind. Mystery solved. Uh, this one is missing a branch there. Okay, so you can figure out which way it's facing. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and see the branch is missing there. So you gotta you gotta look at it from the other direction. There's no fruit here, guy. But let's see, there's branch, branch, broken. Branch, branch, broken, branch. Branch, 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 branch. I think this is the wrong, is this the wrong side? No, is it? That's the wrong tree. Where's the right tree? Branch, branch, broken branch. 
<clears throat> yeah, it's this side. Okay, but where's the fruit? You gotta see where it doesn't match? Dang it! <laughs> now this is the annoying part. Like, why do we have to... I can even see what the solution is. Why do I have to do this twice? Okay, so, um... Branch, branch... Yeah, okay, so it's gotta be from this direction. Branch, 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 broken. From left to right. Branch, branch, broken branch. Branch, branch... Oh, okay, so... I think we have to find the one, um, what's missing from the picture that there's a, there's like a branch missing here. There, so there's a discrepancy. The fruit was just to get you started on the, uh, the puzzles, I guess. Oh, some bonsai. Very nice. What is this? Someone's been eating... Oh, that's where the apple went. And the branch. Hang on. Is that a puzzle? No. <laughs> Everything's a puzzle in this game. Whoa, what is all this? Oh, that's... uh Somebody's heart. I guess those are lungs? I guess it, I mean, it's a little abstract. Veins? Oh, is, are they veins? Maybe. It looks like the collarbone is connected in that, but I guess it could be veins. <clears throat> did I get? Did that give me access to a puzzle, or did it just open this thing? Okay, can I see any puzzles from here? I don't see any. Um, so that opened the door. What was the last one I did? This one? Is that it? I'm gonna have to take another look in there. Have I been... I think I've been. That's where I went uh, the first time. Okay, that door's closed. Okay, so I guess I. Did I finish this area? I didn't see a puzzle in there. I guess that's it. Uh, okay. I'm assuming this thing gets turned on at some point. That's just kind of a hunch. Alright, so uh, I want to backtrack even further now that I've done the pink tree area. And uh, just try to cross off and like look for environment puzzles and stuff like that. 